As a parent, we want our children to have the best education possible because we want our children to grow up into happy, successful, and productive adults. In order to support our children's learning, we need a close working relationship with schools and clear communication about how our students are progressing in mastering the knowledge and skills necessary for life and work. Grades and report cards should reflect how well a student has met academic goals in each content area, indicate areas of strength and areas where additional time and effort are needed. The challenge with traditional grades is that assignments, classwork, homework, tests, quizzes, and extra credit are all lumped into one final grade, which does not necessarily communicate the specific academic skills a child knows and can do. For example, a C can tell you that your child may be struggling in math class, but it does not say exactly what your child understands or does not understand. Does he or she know how to multiply and divide fractions, but is struggling with geometry? Grades should provide parents and families such explicit, constructive feedback that parents have a clear understanding of the knowledge and skills children are expected to learn as they progress through their education. As a teacher, standards-based grading has helped me to communicate with parents, it's helped me to communicate with the student, and it's helped me to be more targeted in the classroom. It's helped me to get rid of some of the fluff, some of the lessons that might not best target those specific standards that these children need in order to progress on to the next grade level or to progress on to college and career. Let's use a sports analogy. Say your child is a competitive baseball player and he is looking to improve his batting average in order to make the varsity team. So you hire a batting coach. Would you keep paying a coach to give your child private lessons if after every training session he simply said, practice more? No, I wouldn't either. Coaches analyze stance, swing, force, and follow through. Coaches provide constructive feedback, run drills, and network with college recruiters. Effective grading practices should communicate as effectively as a good sports coach, and that is the goal of standards-based grades. Each grade level has a comprehensive set of academic standards established by the state of California. These common learning goals are designed to reflect the knowledge and skills that our children need for success in college and future careers. In standards-based grades, students' work is utilized to gather evidence of learning progressions towards mastery of these standards. How a child learns is evaluated separately from what a child learns. For example, academic grades in math, language arts, science, and social studies are scored separately from work habits, study habits, attendance, and behavior. A well-rounded, high-achieving student will not only demonstrate mastery of content standards, but model exemplary work ethic in all disciplines. Standards-based grades give students the chance to focus on acquiring skills for continual growth. If a player misses the ball, we shouldn't look at it as a bad thing. We should look at why the ball was missed and focus on how we can improve for next time.